All we have against Dr. Franchella are the forgeries. Mm -hmm. Did anything turn up in her financials? No, we've been over it three times. She didn't take a dime for any of this. But she does donate a sizable amount to charities. Well, what's she looking at in terms of jail time? Seven years. Time's 32. That's a lot of time over some paperwork. And if Zoe's parents make a victim statement after a conviction, don't be surprised if she gets double digits upstate. They're really pushing this. I can't say I blame them. Well, I think this woman's practically a saint, forgery or not. You'd let some doctor rip your kid's heart out while, while it's still beating in her chest? Two separate doctors declared her brain okay, dead. Okay, so, so you're saying hospital bureaucrats should get to decide what parents do with their dead child's body parts? I'm not saying that. I'm with Carisi. I, mean, I don't see what the big deal is. Dead is dead. Everybody has the right to their own opinion. But as it stands now, if you don't have explicit consent to harvest a dead child's organs, it's a felony.